happy Monday. I just got back from dropping off the kids and I went to go order some pizza, some pizza, <laughs> some donuts because it's Aiden's birthday on Wednesday and I want to do those happy birthday donuts. So I went and ordered those at our little donut shop and um, it was a little pricier than I expected it to be. But we got them ordered and now I'm home to work out. Off the bed. Off. But I wanted to make the bed because we just I just washed all the sheets yesterday. And um, Lover keeps getting on the bed. So if I make the bed, he only gets on like the edge versus like trying to sit all over the pillow like a dirty dog. There's pillows in the bathroom. All done. And now Lover can get on this part of the bed if he wants. Amigas, coming to you from my closet. It's really coming along and I wanted to show y'all. Um, I want to film a video of some sort. I want to do a TikTok and I need to like film. So I'm going to try to attempt to style and film some content today. But let me show you how the closet's looking because it's looking fabulous. I've been arranging and rearranging and rearranging. I feel like I put everything in here and then I had to like figure out where everything's gonna go um, according to the space I have. I just wanna show you what I recently did like over the weekend. We put the mirror up. I brought my little stool that I had. We put a door on this section. Like this area was not gonna have a door. Alfredo had actually said, maybe we should get doors for these, but I'm like, mm, I don't know. But this I did agree with. I did think that a door needed to be here because this is where my dresses are. And because of the space is so, small i have my dresses are being hung with these i was using little coke what are they called i was using little coke uh things but now i have i have these little things that i purchased from shein because they were dirt cheap and i have my dresses hanging like this so because i have that i feel like the colors are kind of mixed together and there's just a lot going on and so i was like well i wouldn't mind closing this off i also have some like pants. I have pants over here that I don't want to fold over and hang on like a pant hanger. So I have them like this, like trousers and stuff. And then I had a box that had sandals in there. But now I was we got this little basket that pulls out. So it has all of my sandals in there for now. And I think that's kind of where they're going to live. Um, and yeah, so I feel like this was a good idea for this area because I'm able to close it off and it looks very neat. I did some reorganizing of my bags. There's a bag missing here. I moved some over here. And then I also got this mirror at Home Goods slash Marshalls over the weekend. The whole thing is glass. The black part is glass and it's that Rachel Zoe brand. It was kind of pricey, but I really like it. And once the rug is in here. I think it's really going to bring in like the blacks and the greens and the neutrals. But yes, that's what I've been up to. That's how the closet's coming out. I can't wait to show y'all when it, once it's all done. Hope y'all had a good weekend. We had a fabulous weekend. We went to, I think y'all back up. We went to Ariel's spring show on Friday and it was kind of like storming and rainy, but luckily it like let up by the time it was for us to go. So we were able to go see her and watch her dance for the last time of her junior year and next year she'll be a senior. Saturday I went to like Ross and Marshalls and stuff to look for stuff. And yeah, so we didn't really do anything over the weekend. Wednesday, however, is Aiden's birthday. He'll be turning 10. Hello, I put myself together. I got ready. I filmed a TikTok. I haven't posted it though. I'm also downloading a two week vlog again. Oh yeah. Um, I'm gonna go to the store though because I try to. I wanna try to find something for Aiden to unwrap on his actual birthday because tomorrow Stevan, which is our friend, is coming to give him because he's a huge sneakerhead. He's the one that always gets us the sneakers when sneakers come out because Aiden is all about it. We're not on top of it. He buys a lot, so he either gets like first pick or typically wins them because he's purchased so many. I don't really know how it works, but he normally always gets us the shoes that Aiden is looking for. So he bought him some shoes that he actually has been wanting for a while 
for his birthday and he's gonna give it to him tomorrow so he can wear them on his birthday on Wednesday. We also got him a pair of shoes, but they won't be here for his birthday, so he won't be able to open those. Also, this is the outfit for the TikTok. I'll probably post it as a short as well. I'm wearing these wide leg jeans that I bought from Walmart several years ago i feel like now two years ago and i just tend not to wear them because they're like an awkward length their length they're not long enough to really wear with heels so you have to wear like a really low heel but they're too long to wear with flats but i've been liking like the baggy jean look so it just kind of looks like a baggy jean not so much like a wide leg just kind of like a big baggy jean however they fit fine um up here they're not too like baggy so i feel like they fit nicely and then wearing this vest with just my bra underneath. And I'm going to wear my little fanny pack. Just like a little bag off to the side. And my little express sandals. And that is today's look. Okay. What came in the mail? My controller. Hooray! Because we sent it off. Because it wasn't working. And luckily with these controllers they have a one year manufacturer warranty. So I was able to just reach out to Microsoft. Send it in. And they sent this new one. Also. It's my birthday in two days. Yes. So early birthday present. Yeah. Happy birthday. <laughs> it was free. <laughs> okay, we got a bunch of packages in the mail, which I'm about to open up and share with y'all. But I went to Burlington, and I got a shirt for Angelo because we're having Aiden's party this Saturday. And it's at a place called Nerfies. And they, um, oh gosh. And everything's like glow in the dark. So I got this for Angelo so he can have a little glow in the dark moment. He already has a shirt that I found for him over the weekend. And then this little Lego PJ set was six, seven dollars? Seven dollars. So I got him a little PJ set because we know they're always outgrowing their PJs. Um, and then I went to the Dollar Tree because I wanted to get a bunch of these like um, glow in the dark like glow sticks so they can wear necklaces and bracelets for I'm also starting to buy things for Angelo's birthday because he's having a pool party and I decided yesterday that things going to be black and white checkered and yellow smiley faces and I wanted like neon colors so I got these trunks for Aiden and some like bright orange trunks for Angelo that haven't gotten here yet and I also picked up these press on nails which are so cute I keep seeing people with these nails on social media and I was going to let my nails rest for like the next week or two so then maybe i'll put these on or maybe i'll save them for the party because i think that would be cute for the party too they're so cute i've been eyeing these on zara's website and they were like 60 bucks and they went on sale for 29 so i got these for 30 dollars. they are a zebra print and look at how cute they're like um they're like a canvas material let's see if i can focus gold buckle on there and i'm I think these are so cute and then from amazon i got this little set which i didn't really care for the top it's got a little crochet triangle top which i won't be wearing um but i wanted this skirt it's this i thought it was red it's more like a burnt orange what is this called um tangerine but i have a vision because i saw somebody try on like a cream knit skirt from i want to say this from zara and an oversized button-up white shirt kind of off the shoulder and when I saw this uh, on Amazon I was like oh that would be so cute imagine that with these sandals I lied I could potentially wear this because this is big enough it's crochet you could wear like pasties with it and with the appropriate attire these could work I also got a diffuser I have a what is that I have a the yellow the yellow brand um head dry hair dryer which i can't think of the name and i've been wanting to get a diffuser but it was like 30 bucks or something i was like oh, i don't want to pay 30 dollars for just the the attachment so i found this for i think 16 and it like uh, it's supposed to fit like any hair dryer essentially and so i'm going to see dry bar i couldn't think of it so dry bar is the yellow one and this so they sold one that obviously fits here as an attachment but this one should just go over it like so this is kind of like silicone rubber so it should fit any oh i like that and i like how big it is because hello and happy 
Happy Tuesday. I am making myself a quick breakfast. I'm going up to the school today because they have a celebration for Dia de los Niños. Dia del Niño. And they were supposed to have a celebration last week, but it was rained out. So we're going to have the celebration today. So I just got home and I'm about to wrap Aiden's gift. I had to go get some paper. And this is the gift that um, our friend got him. Our, our shoe plug. <laughs> he got these. Um, Jordans and he's been wanting these for a while. Here is the gift. I wrapped it up for our friend so he just give it to him um, later today. He wanted a birthday hat because he said um, it was somebody's birthday. She was a girl and she had a sash and I said it's my birthday. So I wasn't able to find a hat that said it's my birthday but I was able to find the little pin that says it's my birthday. And then I bought these party hats because he's like, can you give me a hat? <laughs> so I'm like, like a party hat? And he said, yeah. So I found these hats and I thought maybe he could wear it and we could like put the pin on there or he could just wear the pin or just wear the hat, whatever he wants. So I bought party hats. Okay, this is my thought process. I've got these noodles that I use for my boots and I'm gonna stick it to a water bottle like this and then put this around it obviously cut the top off and then that has a hole here so I was gonna put like skewers in there with little things on top like targets maybe his name the number 10 the nerve symbol something like that as centerpieces that was my plan so just pretend okay here's my vision I did it <laughs> I made these with skewers so I made them uh, with shish kebab shish kebab skewers and then I made them at different lengths that way I can put the different little things on there and then happy birthday to you happy birthday to you happy birthday dear Aiden <laughs> happy birthday to you I'm ten, I'm ten. <laughs> oh, they got me. <laughs> oh yeah. This is what Aiden got for his birthday. That's what he asked for. He actually connected it before he went to school today. <laughs> Hello amigos, the camera is about to die, but I am uh, folding laundry because my mom is actually arriving in just a few minutes. Well, she said about 30 minutes right now that I talked to her, but um, if y'all don't know, if y'all haven't been here a while, my mom lives in Mexico and she comes and visits us about twice a year. And so she'll be here for a month or two and she kind of rotates from my house and my sister's house and her friend's house and so she arrives today and um and she stays in the boys room so I was doing laundry making sure that the sheets were clean and everything was tidy I'm trying to get all the laundry done which I was already working on for the week but I'm trying to put away all the laundry the clean laundry that's in the baskets right now lover is on my bed snoring you hear him um but yeah that's what i've been doing aiden wants to go eat at cc's tonight for his birthday which is fine with me because one i love cc's and two um we um that's his like new that's like his new favorite spot to go is to go to cc's he's like obsessed with their salad so that's what we're gonna do for the birthday boy we picked up some boba right now he had a great day at school and then um yeah that's pretty much it uh, and then party on Saturday for him. We're gonna have some friends also stay in the night. Look, my mom got these boots. Amigos, aren't they nice? From Mexico. They both have the same one. One last present, let me see. Hey. These are nice.
What is it? Huh? What was on there? Have you in the car <laughs> and y'all are foggy because it's hot. Can y'all see me? It's still foggy. I gotta turn this off. Hello and happy Monday. I'm about to head out. I haven't talked to you all day, but I've been trying to film and um, in the new closet for the first time. Um, and right now I'm going to go take my uh, friend to go pick up her car at Discount Tire. <laughs> and then I'm going to go get the boys for school. But, um, yeah, that's what I've been doing today, which is why I haven't gone on. But I hope you had a great weekend. Mine, um, mine was good. It was busy because it was Aiden's celebration. So we ended up doing um, his party on Saturday, then had a sleepover. Then the kids wanted to go swimming in the morning because we were supposed to do it Saturday night, but that didn't work out because it rained. Friday we prepped for the party, but Alfredo had some friends over from work. So um, he made hamburgers for them. They hung out. He stayed up late. Then we did last minute cleaning kind of after, well, I did last minute cleaning and um, a little bit that Friday evening. And Saturday I did some cleaning, uh, but also on Friday I got to go shopping with my mom, which was nice because I was kind of in a cruddy mood. Um, it just was a it was an up and down week last week, as y'all may know already. So yeah, it was nice to get out and like get my mind off of things, and then and that was it. And then Sunday we just kind of recouped from having boys over that stayed up until six a.m., which we slept. I just ate dinner, so I'm going to read my lipstick and then I keep filming. I wanted to say it is so nice to be able to film in the same spot where everything's at because my dilemma with filming in the house is that I have my closet in the bedroom, but I film in the back restroom, which is like the biggest area for me, and then... My shoes were in there. <laughs> my, I'm kind of, I was spread out all over the place because my shoes are in that bathroom. We made like what would be a linen closet, my shoe closet, and then my closet was in the bedroom. I just feel like I was always going like back and forth and leaving everything. I just had, my stuff was everywhere. So now it's so nice to have everything in one area and I can literally grab, try it on, style it, and then put it back. And that is so nice because now, the house is in a mess like it normally would be that I came out because I brought some clothes to hang up but I also was about to tell them that I need to not film when the boys are home because Angelo kept coming out to bug me and he got bit by mosquitoes like four times so mm -hmm. note to self don't film when the kids are home hello friends hello amigas it is Wednesday. It's a Wednesday and I am in my closet <laughs> because that's just where you're gonna find me nowadays every time. Um, I was bringing something out here because I wanted to film. I just posted a uh, collective haul and styling of some items that I've recently purchased. I'm about to try to film. I got two pieces from Amazon from this brand which is the brand that I have those two piece set from in white and in that like yellow color but it's not yellow to me it's like chartreuse or like a green it's definitely chartreuse but they reached out to me oddly enough and i'm like oh i love your sets and they wanted me 
to review this like um, sweat shorts and sweatsuit. It's a sweat shirt and sweat shorts, <laughs> but it's a set that's a sweatshirt. And so I picked the black. I want to try this on, but I also saw that they had this really cute romper on there. So I'm excited. It sent me. Um, it's like a half zip sweatshirt it's like a boxy square fit i do have it tucked into my bra and then these shorts are also like sweat pant material sweats material they are a little long but like in a good way like these are perfect for like running around maybe if you're gonna go like hang out with the kids go to a soccer game or something like that my underwear are falling <laughs> but um yeah so i just hiked them up kind of high to give so they won't be so long but I think they fit really nicely. This, uh, I got this set in black, but it also comes in a bunch of other colors. It's got really big This pocket. is a little romper. I definitely think this is going to shrink. I knew that the, the neckline was really deep, so like it comes down to here. I'm obviously wearing a bra, but you could just put a little something there and it wouldn't be that deep. I'm wearing a small. It fits so cute. I really like it for like just lounging around, taking on vacation, throwing it over like a swimsuit or something. Um, but also for like the Texas summer because it's so hot here. It has a little like shirt collar up here. Again, very low cut, but look at how cute it is. I like it. Mother's Day in Mexico today. And so I went to get flowers for my mother-in-law. Look at these beautiful pink hydrangeas. Gorgeous. And these peonies i think they're peonies anyways i'm going to put this around them to make it look nice and then give it to my mom and i got this really cute cupcake too i'll show it to you right now once i bring it inside the little cake really okay take them out happy thursday <laughs> um i I just got back from dropping off the kids. We went and got donuts this morning. I'm about to go inside and work out, but my mom is still asleep. I went in there and everything's still really quiet, so I'm trying not to make noise. But I thought I'd chat with y'all. Yesterday was um, yesterday was Mother's Day for like Mexico, so I went and got them flowers. I think I showed y'all. And Alfredo, um, I got my mom flowers and the cake, and so did, and for you, you as well, but Alfredo took the flowers and the little cake um in the evening time to her after he got back from work and yep yeah, that's pretty much it today we're going to get out and go shopping a little bit my mom's gonna pick up a gift for my sister we're supposed to get together on saturday and so um i guess we'll do our little mother's day exchange then i still have to get my mom's present which i know what i'm getting her but i have to go physically get it and then uh, i guess i'll pick up something for my sister today because i haven't gotten her anything <laughs> Because that's what I am, a procrastinator. It's definitely my toxic trait. I am a procrastinator to my core. So I'm going to get all the shopping done hopefully today and tomorrow. And then I see my sister on Saturday. We also have to get something for you because her birthday is on Saturday as well. And we're going to see her Sunday. I think that's the plan is to get together Sunday. Got a very large package from First Form. I don't know if y'all heard of it before. I had never heard of it until they reached out to me. And I told them um, that I would love to try their stuff, but I didn't know they were going to send me literally almost everything that they carry. Um, and they also sent me some apparel, so I'll be wearing that tomorrow for my workout. And I'm going to be trying some of their stuff. So if y'all have tried them, let me know what y'all think. It's my mom's birthday today. I made breakfast for mom, so that's her birthday, but I won't get her because she just took a shower. This is two weeks and a few days my eyebrows my lashes you'll see a difference 